know about general insurance its advantages and disadvantages general insurance helps us protect ourselves and the things we value such as our homes our cars and our valuables from the financial impact of risks big and small from fire flood storm and earthquake to theft car accidents travel mishaps and even from the costs of legal action against us insurance in some form is as old as historical society so-called buttery contracts were known to merchants of Babylon as early as 4000-3000 BCE. Under a buttery contract, loans were granted to merchants with the provision that if the shipment was lost at sea the loan did not have to be repaid. The interest on the loan covered the insurance risk. Marine insurance became highly developed in the 15th century. Fire insurance arose much later, obtaining impetus from the Great Fire of London in 1666. No discussion of the early development of insurance in Europe would be complete without reference to Lloyd's of London, the international insurance market. It began in the 17th century as a coffeehouse patronized by merchants, bankers, and insurance underwriters, gradually becoming recognized as the most likely place to find underwriters for marine insurance. Owing to the risks posed by natural calamities, diseases, medical emergencies, and accidents, general insurance covers is something that can provide a blanket of financial protection from them. Accidents and misfortunes cannot be predicted, but it is in our hands to make sure that we are prepared. General insurance is the insurance of assets, financial assets included. If, due to a contingency which is covered under the plan, there is an economic loss, the loss is compensated by general insurance policies. Health insurance plans, which are a type of general insurance plan, allow you tax benefits The primary functions of insurance are insurance provides certainty. Insurance provides certainty of payment at the uncertainty of loss. Insurance provides protection, risk sharing, prevention of loss. It provides capital, it improves efficiency, it helps economic progress. Definition, insurance contracts that do not come under the ambit of life insurance are called general insurance. The different forms of general insurance are fire, marine, motor, accident and other miscellaneous non-life insurance. Like life insurance, general insurance products come at a price in the form of premium. Along with financial security, insurance gives you peace of mind. Your home insurance policy will help you get coverage for damages to the home. Your family float or medical insurance plan will cover you and your family at the time of hospitalization. Any insurance plan comes in handy at a time of crisis. A general insurance is a contract that offers financial compensation on any loss other than death. It insures everything apart from life. A general insurance compensates you for financial loss due to liabilities related to your house, car, bike, health, travel, etc. Advantages of insurance. Insurance provides economic and financial protection to the insured against the unexpected losses in consideration of nominal amount called premium. It provides financial protection to the nominee in case of the premature death of insured. Principles of insurance contracts are utmost good faith and insurable interest. Proximate cause. Indemnity. Subrogation. Contribution. Loss minimization. Insurance turn accumulated capital into productive investments. Insurance also enables mitigation of losses, financial stability and promotes trade and commerce activities those results into sustainable economic growth and development. Thus, insurance plays a crucial role in the sustainable growth of an economy. A policy or agreement between the policyholder and the insurer which is considered only after realization of the premium. The premium is paid by the insurer who has a financial interest in the asset covered. The insurer will protect the insured from the financial liability in case of loss. Disadvantages of insurance are term and conditions. Insurance does not bear every type of loss that occur in individual and business, long legal formalities. Fraud agency, not for all people. Potential crime incidents, temporary and termination, can be expensive. Rise in subsequent premium. The three most important types of insurance are property, liability, and life. The business adequately insured provides the following benefits as provides bodily injury coverage, provides property damage coverage, covers for advertising liability, helps minimize the financial losses, coverage for lawsuits and settlements, helps promotes business continuity. Aids in risk sharing. Insurance means that, in times of damage or loss, you are less likely to be left to pay the full cost on your own, which could leave you in a financial crisis. 
Moreover, whether you're a born warrior or an unflagging optimist, a plan every detailed person or someone who is happy to go with the flow, purchasing an insurance policy, which you hopefully never have to use, buys you something priceless peace of mind. Thanks a lot of watching the video please feel free to give suggestion, send motivational videos for the of benefit society, raise your voice by making and sending plays, stories etc let us create awareness together. Please feel free to call us if you require any help, you can also be a part of our team or channel as a member or associate please call us our contact phone no at 9818003999 or on another phone no at 9540003999 or email at info.consumertimes at gmail.com visit our website www.consumertimes.in please like this video please like share and subscribe our channel will motivate our team to work hard thank you